by last year's winner. One year ago, 25-year-old Shandy Finnessy was working on her master's degree in counseling. But then, suddenly, the eyes of the nation were on Shandy. USA is Shandy Making her the first ever title holder from the state of Missouri. With barely a moment to catch her breath, Shandy flew to her new Trump apartment in Manhattan to begin her whirlwind adventure. As a role model for young women all over the country, Shandy enjoyed a nationwide tour of personal appearances, photo shoots with top fashion photographers, and invitations to glamorous high-profile events, plus appearances on national and local television and radio shows. During her reign, she traveled the country as an advocate for such organizations as the Ovarian Cancer Research Fund and Gilda's Club. She traveled to Ecuador, where she competed in the Miss Universe 2004 pageant, and then on to places like Guantanamo Bay, Cuba, Thailand, Germany, and to Korea, where she participated in a USO tour. For Shandy, it has been a year full of life-changing experiences, a year she will take with her forever. And now, please welcome the reigning Miss USA, Shandy Finnis. Shandy, very important. First of all, Billy says that uh, he's not balding in any way, shape, or form. Can you check that out for me? Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> he's right, right? All right. We love you. <laughs> <laughs> and what was the highlight of your year as Miss USA? Oh, my gosh. I have so many incredible highlights. But um, if I had to choose one, it would probably be competing for Miss Universe in Quito, Ecuador. You have 80 of the most beautiful, intelligent, articulate women from all over the world. And uh, it was an amazing experience to all come together and have harmony for three weeks when there's so much conflict in the world. But I think um, I also finishing first runner up was definitely kind of icing on the cake, so. <laughs> now, it's a live show. These delegates back here are nervous. Anything can happen. Their dreams could be made. What do you say to them if you bump into them in the hallway? Just to be in the moment. Uh, just really take this all in. They say that a parent has a higher probability of having a son play in the NFL than having, or having a daughter son playing the NFL, but having a daughter compete here. So with that said, to just be in the moment, just absorb this and store it in their soul. Well, I want to say Good you look advice. great up there, and thank you very much, Andy. Good thank to you see very you. much, Andy.